to Forever Enchanted. It's me, Nancy Pants, and today we're actually going to do a Sailor Moon merchandise haul. Ooh! So as you guys know, I recently came back from uh, my honeymoon in Japan. We visited Tokyo um, and we also visited Osaka and <sighs> one of my many, many obsessions is Sailor Moon. If you guys don't know what Sailor Moon is, it is it was originally a manga that turned into an anime in, in the 90s, and then it got rebooted in uh, a couple years back. I want to say in like 2015. I might be wrong about the year, but it did get uh, rebooted as Sailor Moon Crystal. And I absolutely love Sailor Moon so much, as you can probably see. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys the awesome things that I got in Japan that were Sailor Moon related. A lot of it is makeup and some of it is like dishes and stuff, but hopefully you guys enjoy the video. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is a gachapon. So if you guys don't know what this is, um, you actually go to little machines. It's like the ones here that have like the tiny toys for kids. Um, it is super, super popular in Japan. They have like pop-up ones that just randomly show up and it's many 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 but these ones are this is Sailor Moon and this is actually a mirror of her compact isn't that so cute hold on let me see let me open it up This is so, so cute. I love it. I was very excited to get it once I, um, once I opened it up. So they have several different kinds. Aw, man. And then you can see them here. So they have Neptune, Uranus. They have uh, this one's Sailor Moon. They have two of Sailor Moon's scepters. And then, or three of the scepters, because I think this is the original scepter she has is Princess Serenity, and then as she gains power, her scepters change. And the outer senshi. So, very cool. So I'm going to start off with what I got in Kitty Land, and then um, in other stores, and then I'm going to go through, like, the Sailor Moon Cafe. So I'll try to let you guys know where I got what trying to like place everything so I can uh, I'll try to let you guys know where I got what and uh, we'll go from there so the first thing is from a store in Harajuku oh that's loud called Kitty Land and uh, I did some research before I went to the store to see if they had any Sailor Moon stuff and I kind of just googled like where can I find Sailor Moon makeup in Japan and they said Kitty Land Handsome so I got a couple of things. Like I mentioned in my previous videos, I did say that you guys would be seeing face masks, face masks, oh my god, a lot because they were all so cute. So the first face mask is Chibiusa! And it is actually her face. So <laughs> I'm excited to try it out, but it's also gonna be really creepy. Who doesn't want to wear other people's faces? The next item I got is eyeliner. <gasps> and it's uh, actually Sailor Moon's scepter. So there's this one. And then I got this one as well. I'm very excited to try these out, guys. I think I'm going to do a like get ready with me video using all of the Sailor Moon makeup, but for right now I'm just going to show it out. But aren't these so cute? Oh my god, I've seen these on like Pinterest and like Instagram and uh, this is for sure one of the things I wanted to get. So the other two items in this bag are pretty cool. So these are lipsticks. This is the Sailor Moon uh, Makeup Moisture Rouge. And this is the Sailor Jupiter lipstick. So they're both lipsticks. At first I didn't quite know what they were, 
But then, oh, yeah, as you guys know, I can't open anything. <laughs> so they are lipsticks, and they look, this is the Sailor Moon one. <sighs> it's her Transformer pen! Oh my god. <laughs> Isn't it so cute? Ugh. So cute. So it opens up like that. And as you can see, it's a really bright pink color, which is appropriate for Sailor Moon. And Sailor Jupiter's. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. So this is Sailor Jupiter's color. So I got these two in, uh, so I got this, these two in Kitty Land. Now, when we were there, they did let us know that uh, that the brushes, like the Sailor Moon brushes, were actually going to be available for sale that Saturday. So I did go back and try to find it. <sighs> Unfortunately, the actual compact that I wanted to get was not available, but I was able to pick up one of the brushes. So give me just one second. Okay, and we're back. So. Like I said, another face mask, and this is Luna. You can see what the face mask looks like right there. I can't wait for you guys to see my Instagram soon because I'm going to start using these and it's going to be creepy land and it's going to be great. So there's Luna. I got this lovely, lovely little bow. So what it's supposed to be is a facial washing puff. Facial washing puff. But it was in the shape, oh my god, it's upside down. It was in the shape of Sailor Moon's bow, and I mean, I couldn't not get it. I think this is actually Chibiusa and not Sailor Moon because of the thing, but I think this is Chibiusa. So I did end up getting the brush, so let me try and get it out here. So this is what the brush looks like. Okay, right now you guys are like, this is not a brush, but check it out. Okay. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. No, it's right there. Ah! <laughs> That's so cool. And it goes back to being the rod. Oh. <gasps> this is so, so cool. Okay, and that's back in its box. So the next item I'm going to show you guys is one of the items that I didn't originally think I was going to get. Um, the reason for it was because I looked at it at the price and I was like, oh god, I, I don't know. And then I went back and I didn't have, they didn't have the compact because, because it was sold out. So I was like, you know what, I'm just going to do it. And I ended up getting it. So in the actual show, um, they all have communicators that they wear on their wrists and then that's how they communicate with each other. So this is communicator lip gloss and this is what the box looks like. You guys want to see the back? My nose is going crazy. And they look like this. <laughs> this is so cool. I kind of want to give one to each one of my friends and be like, listen, you are now our Sailor Scout, whether you know it or not. So, so it's actually a like wrist watch that you can wear if you wanted to, but the little compact is a lip gloss. So if you open it up, you have your lip gloss there. And it does have, so this is Sailor Moon. You have Sailor Venus, and Sailor Venus is more of like an orangey pink lip gloss. Can you guys see it? Am I holding it too far away? So there's Sailor Venus. Here is Sailor Jupiter. And hers is like a green lip gloss. Say goodbye, it's just to her. 
She is the one that Sailor Moon. You guys don't understand how excited I am about this. Sailor Mars. And I'm going to assume this is red. It is! They don't have like a, like a smell. That's good. And of course, Sailor Mercury. I'm gonna guess that hers is blue. It is. Oh, this is so cool. Again, one of the things that I absolutely needed to get, uh, like I said, I wasn't gonna do it at first, but then I was like, come on, man. How can you not? How can you not? So we actually visited the Sailor Moon Cafe in Osaka while we were there, and it was so great. Um, some of the food was very, very pretty. Not so very, very tasty. Um, I did end up getting the tuxedo mask uh, curry, which was delicious. Uh, Chris ended uh, got the Luna and Artemis like slider burgers, which were very yummy, but they were very small, so we ended up having to eat somewhere else. I ended up getting um, <coughs> two desserts. One was the pancakes. The pancakes had Princess Serenity and Prince Endymion on it, and uh, I got the Sailor Jupiter dessert as well, along with the Luna Ball soda. And what was it? It was a Luna Ball soda and a drink that was Sailor Uranus and Sailor Neptune inspired, and then a mango like smoothie that had Sailor Moon's face on it. I think at the end of the video, I'm probably just gonna do like a mini slideshow of all the food that we experienced while there. So the drink that Chris ordered, which was the uh, Sailor Uranus and Neptune inspired one came with an actual mini keychain. Actually, let me make it easier on you guys. So it came with this keychain. Can you guys see that? Is it focusing? Um, and it was it was weird. It, it was a very like odd combination of flavors. So uh, we didn't exactly like the drink. It was very pretty, but it wasn't much to our taste. The excuse me, the Luna Ball drink was very tasty. It was very much just like a grape soda. Um, the pancakes were really good, but they were very. <sighs> It's hard to describe because you would imagine that they'd be like regular pancakes, but they really weren't. And so it was, they were very filling. So I will say that they were very filling. The, um, the sliders were very good. They were very small though, so I could see why we needed to. <laughs> um, but they were very, very cute and they were very good. Then the mango smoothie drink was very pretty. But, we tried it and I don't know what it was supposed to be because it did not taste very good at all. And I feel so sad saying that because it was so pretty but it was just, it didn't taste good. We tried it, we tried mixing it and it was just But again, very pretty. And so we got the Sailor Jupiter uh, dessert, which was like a little like sandwich and like two breads and it had a whole bunch of cotton candy in the middle. And I grabbed it like a sandwich and I bit into it and it actually had this like raspberry filling on the inside. It was so good. Everything was so sweet, a little bit too much, but it was just so very, very, very good. So. It was a great experience. Not all of the food was to our liking, but it was just such a great experience. I was able to luckily take a picture of the chalice parfait that they had. Um, the lovely girls next to, next to us allowed me to take a picture of her dessert, and uh, it was very, very pretty. They did say that they liked it, so. So I did buy a couple things there. So the first item I'm gonna show you is actually a drink stir. Stirrer, stirrer. 
and it has Sailor Moon's chalice on top. And it's just a normal drinkster, but I mean, one of those silly things that I was like, mm, yes, yes. So there is that. We also, I also got, uh, one, two, one, oh, five, okay. I also got five coasters, and these are kind of surprise coasters, so I'm not really sure which ones we got. So let's open them together. So the first coaster is, oh, it's Sailor Uranus. Oh, I'll go, oh, I need to like hold it closer. Very cute. So this is actually like a drawing of the drink that we ordered. So that's cool. Oh, and it says her actual name, Haruka. So it says it on the bottom. Oh, this is so good. All right, number two. I hope we got like different ones. <laughs> I mean, we could have duplicates. <gasps> yes! We got Usagi, which is Sailor Moon. Ah, this is exciting. Oh, she's so pretty. Okay, on to our third. I really just wanted to say, but we got oh Satsuna Sailor Pluto. Yeah, Pluto. I was gonna say Saturn. I was like, no, she's not Saturn. Very cool. Let's see. On to our fourth. Oh, it's Amy. This is Sailor Mercury. I'm giving away their secret identities. And our very last one. Let's see what we got. Chibiusa! Yay! I'm trying to get it to focus. Oh, these are so cool. I'm very happy with the selection that we got. I'm very happy that we got Sailor Moon and Chibiusa and some of the Sailor Scouts. It would have been better to get all of the Sailor Scouts, but to be honest, like, these were pretty expensive on their own, and so I didn't get all of them, but I'm very happy with what we got. <laughs> oh. Okay, so the other, uh, Four items are two cups and two plates, and they were, like I said in my previous video, I am obsessed with house things, and I love cups, and I love plates, and these were just things I needed in my life, because it's Sailor Moon, and if I could fill my house with Sailor Moon, I would. So this is actually, I think it's for more of a bathroom, but, and as you can see, it's pink, it has Sailor Moon on it, it has all of her, like, wands, and then some of the Sailor Scout swans. Her bow. It's very, very cute. It looks a little purple on camera, I think, but this is actually pink. So there is cup number one. And so with this second cup, it looks almost identical. Like if you're not really paying attention, which when I first looked at it, I really wasn't, it looked exactly the same. It's not, it's a very, very subtle difference, but. So this is actually purple, and the wands are a little bit different. They, it has the, it has Pluto's little uh, wand there, it has Saturn's wand, it has Neptune, Uranus, Chibiusa, so it's very, it's different, but it's like subtle. Like if you're, if you're not looking for it, you're not gonna find it. And I got the matching plates that go with the cups. So give me one second to just unbox these. So the plates have the same design as the cups do. So this is the one that goes with the purple one. And it says Sailor Moon Cafe. Hope you guys can see that. And... The second one matches the pink cup and that has that uh, design on it. So it's a little shiny, so I'm gonna try to make sure you guys can see it. How cute! By the way, I just noticed this. 
And Shibiusa has the Luna drink that we ordered. Let's see, can we focus? She has a little loose, so that's what the actual drink looks like. And then I have like an actual picture of it in real life, but it's great. <laughs> um, okay, so I got... Okay, so the next couple of items I actually got at the Sailor Moon store. So while we were in Japan, um, I was actually on Facebook. I think someone shared it on my wall or I don't, I'm not sure, but they just like, while we were there, they put up an official um, permanent Sailor Moon store. Guys, when I heard about this, I was like, yes, we're definitely going. Like, there's no way we're not. Um, so we, we left like super early on Saturday back to Tokyo because I really, really wanted to go to this store. And I was like, we have to, we have to. <laughs> so I did end up going to the Sailor Moon store and I did get a couple more items. So this is what the Sailor Moon bag looks like from the Sailor Moon store. So that's super cute. Oh, I did get some. I did end up getting a chip, another Chibiusa mask. I wasn't sure if I picked it up the first time. So now I have two. I might give this, <gasps> I'm gonna give this to my friend Monique because I know that she would love it. And I got Sailor Moon. So I get to have Usagi's face on my face. That's weird. <laughs> um, I got these cute little candies in this little mug. So this is actually Princess Serenity and her candies are all like white and stuff. These are super cute. I haven't tried them yet, but it's really, really cute and I just needed it. And I got this. Where's the front? Oh, it's right here. So to be perfectly honest with everyone, I'm not really sure what this is. So let's open it and find out together. I wasn't sure if it was snacks or if it was like tea or, I, I just don't know what it is. So I figured we would open it together and we would find out together. Okay, where are the scissors? Every time guys, every time. So. This is what the top of this looks like. Sailor Moon. And, oh, it's little candies, I think. Yeah, it says caramel. So it's little caramel candies. Usually in uh, Japan, they have like, Usually in Japan, they usually have like a little like box that has this and it's open um, and it shows you what's inside and they didn't have that there. But I just realized that the cover to the oh, oh my God. As the cover is actually a pen. Oh, that's so cool. Uh -huh. What do you guys say? I think I should try one of these Hello cameras. guys. Sorry I had to use my transformation pen because Negaverse was after me. Just kidding. Uh, my camera battery died and I didn't have time to charge the other camera battery. So I had to wait a couple days to finish this up. I did finish it but it was kind of really rushed so I didn't want to rush it every, like at all. So I wanted to show you guys what I actually got. So, um, I wanted to show you the brooch. Let's see if you guys can see it. This is actually a compact and it has um, clear setting powder on the inside. Super, super cute. And I wanted to show you the other pen. So as you know, at the very beginning, I did get Sailor Moon's transformation pen and it is a beautiful pink shade of pink lipstick. And I also got Jupiter's pen, but I did get the other Sailor Scouts as well. I originally wasn't going to, but they were at a store at the airport and they kind of just called to me and I needed to get them. So I did get Sailor Venus. 
And she has a nice shade of kind of like a coral lipstick. Sailor Mars, which of course is going to be a rouge color. Beautiful red. I'm trying to see if you guys can see it. And Sailor Mercury, which is a nice cute little pink color. So my plan is to do a get ready with me or just do like a makeup uh, video showcasing pretty much all of the products that way we can see them on um, I know with the lipsticks I'll probably do like a lipstick try on video where you guys see all the shades if that's something you guys want to see let me know in the comments below I'll probably just do it for fun anyway <laughs> so thank you so so much for watching the video don't forget to like and subscribe and here we go with the footage of the Sailor Moon Cafe and the Sailor Moon store See you next time! Good morning, guys. Um, guys, my dream. My dream is coming true. We're at the Sailor Moon Cafe in Osaka. Look at how cute it is. Oh, I'm so excited to eat literally everything on the menu. Okay. I'm willing to spend thousands of dollars here. Chris doesn't know it yet, but that's the plan. Isn't it, baby? No. Thousands of dollars. No. Thousands. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. I'll start okay, this back officially up inside the, the uh, Sailor Moon Cafe, and let's be real. I ordered everything. Ooh, your drink looks yummy. I say his drink, but it's actually all mine. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I want to cry. It's not even like funny. Mm. I gotta take all the pictures, so I'll come back.